everyone, my name is Miss Gabby. Welcome to Family Storytime at the Calusa Library. Today we're going to be reading There Was an Old Lady Who Swallowed a Frog by Lucille Colandro and illustrated by Jared Lee. Oh, I'm so excited to read this book. I really like this series. It's so funny. It's so bizarre. Look at the old lady. Why would she eat a frog? Why would anybody do that? Mm -mm. I, I would not want to eat a frog, would you? I don't think so. <laughs> okay, let's get started. There was an old lady who swallowed a frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. My goodness, that poor frog. What is that old lady thinking? And look at his frog friends. They're like, why are you eating my friend? Ugh, will she eat anything else? Hmm, I guess we'll find out. There was an old lady who swallowed some dirt. It didn't hurt to swallow that dirt. She swallowed the dirt to hide the frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. Ugh, she's eating dirt. And what's in the dirt? Worms and other bugs. So not only has she swallowed a frog, she swallowed dirt. And in the dirt, she swallowed a worm. Ugh, what is that lady thinking? There was an old lady who swallowed some seeds. At high speed, she swallowed the seeds. So a truck drove by and she followed the truck and ate the seeds at high speed? Wow, that lady is determined to eat some weird stuff. Frogs, dirt, worms, seeds. What will she eat next? She swallowed the seeds to fill in the dirt. She swallowed the dirt to hide the frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. Hmm. There was an old lady who swallowed the rain. What did she gain by swallowing the rain? Yeah, what does she gain by swallowing the rain? And what kind of pattern of things do we see the old lady eating? So we saw some frogs, we saw some dirt, we saw some seeds, now we're seeing some rain. What is going to happen to all of that stuff in the old lady's body? What is she swallowing? What, where do we see this kind of stuff? We see it during the spring, right? Hmm, what other spring items is she going to eat? She swallowed the rain to water the seeds. She swallowed the seeds to fill in the dirt. She swallowed the dirt to hide the frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. There was an old lady who swallowed the sunlight. Oh, look at her laying in the grass. It was so fun, right, to swallow the sunlight? Uh, what, what is she gonna do? What do you think she's gonna do? <gasps> she swallowed the sunlight to dry up the rain. That makes sense, sort of. She swallowed the rain to water the seeds. She swallowed the seeds to fill in the dirt. She swallowed the dirt to hide the frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. There was an old lady who swallowed some gloves. Oh, how she loves to swallow her gloves. Lady, why don't you just wear your gloves instead of swallowing the gloves? Huh. And what is she going to do with those gloves? She swallowed the gloves to hold the sunlight, and she swallowed the sunlight to dry up the rain. She swallowed the rain to water the seeds. She swallowed the seeds to fill in the dirt. <gasps> What's happening? What's happening to the dirt? What is the rain and the sunlight doing to the seeds in the dirt? Do you see? What's in the dirt? What's happening? She swallowed the dirt to hide the frog. I don't know why she swallowed the frog. She was in a fog. Oh, look at the poor frog. He suffered so much. And that worm. 
the worm, but really the frog. Ugh, poor frog. There was an old lady who swallowed a rake. How was it going to fit in her body? It was a mistake to swallow that rake. See? Of course it's a mistake. It's huge. That is a huge rake. Burp. Oh no, what's going to happen? What's going to come out? So the old lady said, excuse me, I beg your pardon. <gasps> wow, look at all the animals watching. They look a bit horrified. And out spilled a colorful garden. My goodness, look at all of the stuff she swallowed. And look, the seeds, the dirt, the rain, the sunlight. It all created what? Flowers. How pretty. Oh, I'm so glad the frog got out and the rake and the worms. Ugh. But look at the pretty flowers that grew inside of her stomach. Oh, pretty. Happy spring. Yeah, that's right. It's springtime now. It's the time of the year where everything starts growing and flourishing. There's flowers, there's plants, everything. There's happy bees and happy birds and happy frogs. Lots of gardening. Wow, I'm so happy it's spring now. What a funny book. Well, that's the end of our story. The garden that came out of the old lady was so pretty with all the flowers and the frogs and everything. Maybe she shouldn't have eaten it in the first place, but at least it grew and at least it flourished and those flowers were beautiful. <laughs> well, make sure to look at our questions and activities that we've published along with the book. Until next time, bye!